Yeah, it's subject to change, we'll have to say that, but at the minute, Saturday and Sunday, I think are going to offer typical bank holiday oh. weather. A little bit of rain in the forecast. I think bank of holiday course. Monday will get better, though. <laughs> I mean, we've seen the sunshine today. This was captured by Adele in Leicester. I thought this was a beautiful picture here with the sky looking so lovely with the sunshine. And the day started off quite well as well. So thank you to Curly. Claire always takes a lovely photo. This is how it started first thing in Hoveringham. Apparently, the red arrows were over Hoveringham this afternoon, so that was even more exciting. <laughs> But what we are seeing now throughout uh, this evening is a weather front. It's sitting over the northwest of the country. So although we will see clear spells developing for a time tonight, it's also going to offer the odd isolated shower by the time we head into the early hours. And that weather front's been working its way up from the southwest through today, not really producing too much across the East Midlands. And we did get to see a little bit of sunshine as well. But now where it sort of anchors itself, it will then gradually start to work its way down towards the southeast corner. And that takes place through tomorrow. So at the moment, we might just get the odd light showers. We're heading into the early hours from that, but the cloud amounts will vary overnight and we will see a few clear spells developing as well. Temperatures are a little bit milder again than last night, so 13, 14 Celsius the minimum. Quite a bit of cloud around throughout tomorrow due to that weather front. The sun will also break through at times. It is a bit of a mix through the daytime and one or two showers associated with that as well as it starts to head down. Some of this could actually be quite heavy and thundery, so whether that just starts to touch parts of Leicestershire and Rutland later in the day, but 21 Celsius, the maximum temperature. And then as we head towards the bank holiday weekend, well, this is how it looks on Friday. We're going to see temperatures probably close to 19, 20 Celsius again, some showers developing out to the west, working their way eastwards gradually. And then over the weekend, there is the potential on Saturday for some heavy thundery showers, but they tend to ease through the evening. Sunday, slightly wetter again, a bit better on Monday. Oh, well, Monday's dry at least, so that's why <laughs> One thing, isn't it? Thanks, Sarah. That's all we have for now. Nicholas back with the late news from all of us. Bye bye.